Uh, the first part of this book, uh, Insight, is considering the concept of imagination in the first two chapters. Um, the first one is engagement. Um, I really enjoy this book. There's something about it that intuitively makes sense to me. I think it provides a good framework to start viewing uh, a lot of the issues that you're having um, with regard to uh, getting ideas and getting them into reality. Um, I know a number of you have, have expressed uh, that you're pretty good at thinking of things, but making them happen is a real challenge, without a doubt. Um, to me, this concept of engagement is exceedingly important. Um, you know, she talks about an assignment where art history students go and look at a painting for three hours, and it's the same piece of art. And I think of my own experiences, I, I go to museums quite regularly. How many people walk up, take a picture of an absolute masterpiece, and walk on to the next masterpiece, trying to get through the museum as quickly as possible? And I strongly correlate that experience with how some students approach uh, classes. Um, you're not going to be able to fully succeed in this project if you approach uh, the assignments this way and the, the final project. You know, it's not just think of something as quick as possible and that's where we go. No, there, there has to be a certain level of engagement with the topic. Um, or you won't be able to come up with solid solutions uh, in that regard. Um, you know, the other thing that really hit home to me in chapter one is this idea of discovery is um, predicated on curiosity. That's my dog, if you can hear it. Uh, but discovery is predicated on curiosity. And think about that for a long period of time. Take the lesson from staring at the photo and think of the idea of discovery is predicated on curiosity. If you don't know what the, need, the word predicated means, look it up in the dictionary, Google it, it, you'll have it. And think about that. Why are ideas slow coming? Why can't I see solutions? Why can't I truly understand the problem at hand? And I think a lot of it um, will get back to trying to answer the question as opposed to really engaging with the, with the um, mission. Engage with the idea, the concept that you're going to launch a business.